Hello, people. <laughs> How's it going, everybody? Nas here. You're watching Nostalgic. And uh, I got a big-ass box here. Um, I had to rip off the shipping labels because there's a lot of them. <laughs> but uh, this is from my man, Rob. Rob Stubbs, 33 DC, and uh, and Monica, because they're birds of a feather flock together. But um, yeah, this is awesome, man. Um, <laughs> United Kingdom, yeah, man. This is from across the pond. This came all the way from Brittany, from uh, our old friends and friends of the channel, Rob and Monica, and uh, yeah. If you guys remember, uh, last time at the Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction, uh, Rob donated quite a few of his customs, and they all sold for, for good money. And uh, this time around, he made more. Now, this this box is actually super special. Also, it's huge. Uh, like, what the frick, bruh? Like, that is a big box. <laughs> There's my head next to it. I can fit two of my heads in this. So, um, yeah. I asked Rob to make me a custom. It's a Fast and the Furious custom. And I'm very excited about it. But my man made more for the next Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction. Which we're planning on having um, in uh, this month, actually, March. Um, on the 23rd, so not next weekend the weekend after that uh the date is subject to change depending because i know there's some events happening and uh some people might not make it so there's a point to this auction which is to raise funds for ukraine for ukrainian volunteers in ukraine more specifically in lviv and uh those guys do a lot we already raised a lot of money for them in the past uh, it's, it's been two years of this insane war um, of Russia invading Ukraine and uh, doing crazy atrocities, uh, leveling cities, you know, all of the above. Um, they're, they're terrorists. It's a terrorist um, <sighs> country, state, all sorts of things. So uh, people of Ukraine, my people are suffering. Uh, it's been two years. Again, I remind you, a lot of people are forgetting that the war never ended. In fact, in some cases, it got worse. Um, so what I've been trying to do on this channel is try to raise funds with these auctions. I try to do, I try to raise funds with um, claim sales. Um, I also uh, try to donate my own money. Uh, we also try to, well, not try to, we also do um, toy drives on this channel. People donate toys, Hot Wheels, dolls. Uh, people donate money just to to send over. Um, I've been very uh, touched and moved by a lot of you guys uh, that have been donating over the past two years and supporting this cause that we do here. Um, I'm pretty much a volunteer myself, and um, <sighs> no one's paying me to do this. No one's asking me to do this. Um, I just know that I'm not in Ukraine. Um, I can't pick up arms and uh, go do things. For various reasons um, so I'm doing what I can as one person in in America who's Ukrainian uh, to support his people in Ukraine um, this is my cause and uh, with with the help of all of you like Rob and Monica here um, and a whole bunch of you that have been on board since day one I thank you guys you guys are amazing um, I'm just thankful I'm sorry, it's it's pretty much, uh, it's been two years today uh, since this war started. So, um, you know, it, it, I've been watching the news this morning uh, from Ukraine, obviously. So it, it's a little bit hard on me. Uh, so I'm sorry if I'm not like all wacky and funny <laughs> today. I'll try to, uh, you know, my mood's definitely going to punch up when I start open, opening this amazing box. Um, and uh, yeah, just... Uh, you know, just wanted to thank everyone. And if anyone wants to reach out and either just donate, my PayPal is bignaz at yahoo.com. 
just make sure in the notes you write uh, donation for Ukraine and I'll make sure to forward that right away. Uh, if you want to donate like children's clothing, toys, whatever, as long as it's not like used stuff, you know, like it has to be new and not used and stinky. <sighs> so that we can um, ship that right away. We shipped uh, three or four boxes already to Ukraine. That stuff gets dispersed um, amongst um, people that have been affected by the war, especially the kids. Um, you know, it goes to hospitals, it goes to um, orphanages, it goes to just kids that uh, lost their parents. Either their mom and or dad were, um, you know, fighting on the front lines and they lost their their lives. And now there's just the, the kids left. So um, those kids get those things. Um, or in hospitals, you know, every that's what we do, you know, uh, and most most horrific is um, kids that lose their parents to uh, uh, goddamn cruise missiles and rockets and um, uh, drones, the Shahid drones from fucking Iran. Um, just civilian buildings get destroyed uh, with people in them, and uh, there's all these stories and... Um, videos and photos of just parents losing their lives, kids losing their lives. Uh, I mean, they blow up kindergartens, guys. Like, okay, I'm not trying to make this, like, too much of a downer right off the bat, bat uh, the bat, like I have, uh, but um, you need to know what what these donations are for, uh, you need to know what I'm doing here on this channel. Um, yeah, I'm a collector. Yeah, I'm a nerd. Yeah, I do a lot of stuff. Um, I get a lot of stuff for my collection. Look at the crap behind me. Uh, with that being said, I did get rid of a lot of my collection. It used to be about five, seven times that size. I used to collect toys. Uh, I sold pretty much most of that either at these auctions or I went to the flea market and sold that crap there and uh, sent the money over there to Ukraine. So, um, all right, you guys get the point. Uh, so yeah, the next auction we're doing is gonna be right here on this channel. Uh, we're shooting for March 23rd. Uh, it's gonna be a Saturday. Uh, if it's not gonna be that date, I will let you guys know on the channel or stay tuned to my uh, Instagram, which is nostalgic underscore productions or Hot Wheels for Ukraine underscores everywhere. Uh, on Hot Wheels for Ukraine, that's where I put post. Uh, I post photos of um, everything that's going up for auction. So there's no other nonsense there. Just like you see that picture, that's going to be at the next auction. Unless it's that sold, that means it already sold at a previous auction. So everything you see there, that's what you can expect at the auctions. Uh, this auction is going to be very custom heavy. I'm so excited. I have a box full of customs from a whole bunch of different customizers, artists, um, I even have a custom coming from a Ukrainian customizer artist. She's from Ukraine. She lives in Ukraine, and uh, I commi uh, I didn't commission her. I bought one of her pieces that she's sending to me, and then she decided to donate a custom for the next auction. So, like, Ukrainians in Ukraine sending things here <laughs> to auction off to you guys to send the money back to Ukraine to help people there. So, uh, it's just amazing. And uh, Robert, St Robert Stubbs right here, and Monica... Thank you guys. Uh, they've bought things multiple times at previous auctions. Rob's donated his customs uh, to a couple of previous auctions, and there's customs in here. Um, I'll show them to you here as well. Let me start opening this. I'll show you the customs that he sent here, but I will make a separate video um, showcasing just the customs because there's a lot of stuff in this box. So. Um, we don't want this video to be that long, especially now that I've talked for so long for this, uh, intro. So, yeah. Oh, <laughs> this, this is starting out well. Always close this. Alright. So, um, this is 33DC. Check him out on, uh, Instagram. Amazing artist. He makes customs where it's not just painting and whatever, wheel swap, and, like, my man cuts things out. He makes things convertible. Um augments things, uh, makes headlights. Anyway, he, he goes crazy, man. So I I asked him to make me a custom, and I can't wait to open it. So um, anyway, all right, guys. Um, stay tuned to my channel. Stay tuned to my Instagram accounts, where I'll keep you posted. Uh, Slava Ukraini, Heroyam Slava. So thanks, everyone, who's here. 
All right, so oh no, this is gonna be the third one in the series that Rob's been sending me of these um, dots and five ten cards. Every time he sends a box, uh, oh no, where did it go? It's oh, it's okay. <laughs> Hold on. I moved it from a different spot on the wall. So let me show you what he just sent me. He sends me cards like these. They're like high quality prints. My favorite casting is Dotson 510 Wagon. Um, I'm a huge fan of Kaido House, obviously. And um, <laughs> my man knows me. So uh, yeah, I'm going to read that in a second. But here's the very first card he sent me. And I framed it in a two-sided, two, two two-faced, two-sided uh, frame. So I can always remember who this is from and uh, the nice words. I cherish everything I gets, that gets sent to me or to me and Maggie. I appreciate people. I appreciate friendships. Um, okay, so let me read this to you. Uh, Dear Nas and Maggie, hope that this box finds you well. I've sent this... I've... Uh, sent this in plenty of time for the auction yes you did <laughs> uh as always if uh there's a oh by the way i sent him a box about that size so that's been on its way to uh the Brittany. hopefully you'll like it rob there's not a lot for monica because i don't know what to send her bro i we don't know like what she likes so like we're gonna send you guys another box obviously uh after the auction at some at some point <laughs> i'm still looking for license plates for you uh, he collects license plates of America, guys, so if anyone wants to donate a couple of um, license plates uh, from the USA, wherever you live, we don't need New Jersey, we don't need New York, we don't need Pennsylvania, we don't need Georgia, <laughs> but we need, like, a lot of other ones. So if you want to send anything to me, I'll send it to Rob. So he wants to have every every state license plate in his garage. He deserves it, too. But anyway, sorry. Um but yeah, Monica, there's only a couple of little things. I'm sorry, we just didn't know, man. So it's mostly for Rob. So <laughs> we love you, though. You're the best, Monica. Cześć. Dziękuję bardzo. Wyje luksowa panienka? My Polish is awful. I'm sorry. I'm just saying you're an awesome lady. Thank you. <laughs> um, as always, if there's anything uh, you do or don't want feel free to uh to do with what you want with it hopefully i'll be off on the day of the auction so i can join in i'm sure it will be a huge success as i see there's lots of good items coming in from some very talented and generous people all for the good cause keep up all the great work and happy peg hunting best wishes from across the pond rob and monica so there you go Thank you guys, man. This is awesome. And yeah, uh, I there's also um, another one, a third one. So uh, I think that's like being protected somewhere. But anyway, that's fantastic, bro. Let me put that back into this little lovely envelope so I don't ruin it because I love these prints, bro. I love them. Okay. All right, so we're starting out. Well, I'm trying to lose weight. So we're starting off with uh, some candy, some British candy that I believe we don't have in uh, the Americas. Galaxy Ripple. This is going to make Maggie happy as well. And dude, we love these aero things. It's like air, air filled like foam that's been dried, but it's chocolate. These are amazing, bro. So yeah, thank you for those. Those are awesome. Yeah. Oh, let's see that custom, yo. <laughs> Rob, I hope you like everything I said to you, bro. Okay, wow. You, you like, holy crap. Okay. <laughs> so we have some shorties here. I'm going to make sure that this camera is filming well. I can't see what I'm filming. Uh, let me see. <clears throat> From the looks of it, we're doing good. Let me just make sure we're doing very good here not badly all right uh, it's so hard i don't trust that it's recording i never trust oh my god i really need a real freaking camera bro 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 i need the real good camera bro come on okay 
We are back. So, <laughs> we got a shorty. He sent uh, one last time. I kept that biatch. Um, so there you go. This will be available for auction, guys. We have a Donut Drifter. I'm just going to tell you what's here, and then um, what's going to be for auction is going to be for auction. So we'll see how it goes. Sometimes people offer uh, good money to just pick these up before the auction or after the auction. So the point here is to raise money, not to give people deals, you know what I mean? Ooh, I love this little guy. <laughs> A little Porsche. I love, like, these things, these cars on short cards, I feel like they're perfect. You know what I mean? Because they're so cute and little, like, it's like, it needs to be on the short card. <laughs> nice! So, we actually have, ooh, this was donated by my boy Cameron, the long card, and now we have a short card. This will definitely be at the auction as a pair, so someone can have these two treasure hunts in long card and short card form. How cool is that? Rob, bro, I'm, <laughs> I'm so happy, man. You have no idea. <laughs> I probably picked up some kind of a cold at the flea market. I was just there with uh, Vic and Lana. Like, I feel a little bit of a throat situation happening. But, um... So, excuse me if I'm a little weird. So, we have a 83 Chevy Silverado. Also the cute little stubby thing. Oh, that's a keeper. Definitely keeping this because I collect Fast and the Furious. I don't know if I ever told anyone. Ever heard of it, Fast and the Furious? <laughs> so I already have this one from Rob. So I'm going to keep this one to have the two short card uh, pair. That's going to be an awesome thing for my collection for sure. That's great. Man. All right. <laughs> I think we were joking about this. Um... I sent, uh, I think I sent him a long card version of this, and he's like, I'm going to send you the short card treasure hunt of this, <laughs> so, uh, it's not like my favorite treasure hunt, but hey, it's a short card, man, I know that collectors get, you know, um, like me with the Fast and Furious, you know, you want to have it on short card and on long card, it's just fun, whatever, man. Ooh, I know these two are going to be a huge hit. All right, Rob, you are the man, bro. The two highlights of, uh, what was it, uh, B case, I think, that these came out in. And these are short cards. So you have your Civic right here. How cool is that? And you have the Skyline, the purple Skyline. It's freaking awesome, man. Fan freaking tastic. <laughs> Hope there's not too much glare. Again, I, I don't see what I'm filming. That's so cool, dude. Ooh, this is for Maggie. Look at that. Chris Sheets, you're not the only one freaking drawing on cardboard, bro. <laughs> Got competition. I wonder what they sent her. She's gonna be freaking excited about this. Oh, no way, dude. Oh, my God. Guys, Maggie loves Spice Girls. This is, um... Oh, how cool is this? Royal Mail first day cover. Look at that. How cool is that? They're stamps, bro. Oh, she is gonna love this. She's at work right now. Um, I'm gonna try to film her reaction at the end. I'll show this to her when she comes home. And, uh, yeah. So stay tuned till the end. You guys know I always do, um, bonus. That is so cool. <laughs> I don't know. Stupid glare. Please don't glare it up, man. There we go. That is fantastic. Fan freaking tastic. Thank you. Man, you you can pack things, man. Like this is how it's done. Oh, cool, cool, cool. He told me about this, guys. Check this out. Ah, this is awesome. Die cast 
heroes. By the way, check out Diecast Dude on YouTube. I watch his channel a lot. <laughs> uh, he's a cool guy, uh, and uh, I love watching his um, <sighs> peck hunting videos and all that. He goes to different conventions, different stores in Europe, like not just one country to different countries. And uh, yeah, I comment a lot to him. <laughs> but uh, yeah, he's he's behind this magazine, Diecast Heroes. Um, I think there's one that has my uh, my my face on it, or at least my name. I don't remember. It's when I was helping someone out with a podcast, and uh, I think they added my name to it somewhere. So I don't know. But um, anyway, I think this one has Rob in it. Um, oh yeah, here's Tony. That's the diecast dude right there, and his wife, I believe, Carmen. <laughs> Really cool people. Uh, ooh, Fireball Tim's in here too. I got his art up on my wall right now. Um, Benjamin. I need to... Uh, I'm not sure which page you're in. You're on, man. But anyway, um, Rob's in here. So Rob is also a published artist now. I can't wait to look through all this. Cypress Hill, hell yeah. Anyway, these magazines are awesome. I have like, uh, I have two or three of these already that I purchased personally. Anyway, Rob, let me know uh, where you're at. I'll just find it later probably and post it on my Instagram. But uh, Hobbs and Shaw. This is cool stuff, bro. <laughs> this is really cool stuff. If anyone doesn't know, just you, you have to order these uh, online and they'll ship them they'll ship them to you. Uh, but yeah, check it out, man. Diecast Heroes. If you're into diecast, that's the magazine you must must have. Flavor of the West Coast. Alright. Auction number 24, Jack Daniels. Oh, okay. These are the art cards. Yes. So, I need to get the cards out first. So, small spoiler, but I commissioned Rob to make me Roman's Eclipse, the Mitsubishi Eclipse. Um, and yeah, so I can't wait for that. And then there's three other customs that will be going up for auction for you guys to own. <sighs> Rob, thank you. Dude, I don't even know like how much I can think. <laughs> this is amazing. Okay, so I'll put these aside here. Gasser. Chevy Silverado. He made stuff people are gonna want. Oh my god, dude. How much crap is in there? Not, none of it's crap. You know what I mean. <sighs> Purple Eclipse. That's the one. <laughs> Alright. Um, cool. Let's open uh, everything else and then we'll get to these customs in the end. So. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm gonna get emotional up in this bitch. Okay, I have a knife right there. You just sent me a fire truck, dude. Did you just send me a fire truck? A mother. <laughs> Limited edition Code 3 fire engine diecast collectible. Code 3 collectible. I don't know what that means, but. Oh my god. Philadelphia Fire Department? Ah, dude, all the way from the UK, you're sending me the Philadelphia Fire Department fire truck that I see every time I go peck hunting? Oh, bro. E44. I need to find out where that is. Go there and get all the guys to sign, like, the cover. Look at that. 
We are proud to introduce the new Code 3 collectible series, the 1997 edition, Features the modern uh, Seagrave Pumper with authentic city markings. Each collectible will include 164 scale die cast, replica die cast, city emblem, and display case. 164 scale. Oh, man. I'm not going to keep reading. It's just. Wow. Secret 97 country city Philadelphia one of 25,000 limited edition the prayer when I am called to duty God wherever flames may rage give me strength to save a life whatever be its age help me embrace a little child before it's too late or save an older person from the horror of that fate enable me to be alert and hear the weakest shout uh, and quickly and effic eff efficiently to put the fire out. I want to fill my calling, a Lord, and give the best in me to guard my every neighbor and protect his property. And if according to your will I have to lose my life, God bless with your protecting hand my children and my wife. <sighs> Run out of air reading that. Just from everything I was talking about Ukraine and I mean, hell, imagine, like, the firefighters in Ukraine right now. Imagine that. <sighs> Fuck. Firefighters, man. It doesn't matter what country you're in. You guys are... Yeah. Oh, this is a prized freaking possession in my collection. This is... This is simply amazing. Wow. What a beauty, dude. I... <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to make some room over there. That is a surprise. <clears throat> that was an inappropriate burp, but... What the heck is this? Wait a minute. This is another thing for Maggie, I believe, right? Oh, okay. Mm. Unbelievable. Yep. <laughs> oh, you are gonna make Maggie's day. Spice World, the movie. Limited edition individual spice tins. Now I feel like a boob, man. Like, we got all this stuff for Maggie. Like, we didn't even know... All right, so next box is going to be, like, for Monica and, like, one thing for Rob. <laughs> Look at that. Spice World 10, 1997, vintage. I believe this is sporty? Sporty? I don't know. Oh, F and A, dude. It's in a clamshell. In Europe, they're pretty much like that. I collect VHS a little bit, so, oh, it's green. Oh my god. This is awesome. Oh my god, Maggie's gonna be so happy. Look at that. It's the movie. Wow, I didn't realize it was so short. Thought it was a longer movie. <laughs> this is awesome, dude. They don't just sing. <laughs> yeah, so there you go. <laughs> fantastic. Fan freaking tastic. Oh, Maggie, dude. You guys are insane. You guys are insane. All right, we don't have time to waste here. No, the colors. Oh, God, Rob, bro. Man, dude, you're gonna get me so emotional here, bro. Don't make a grown man cry here. 
This is the helmet of one of my absolute heroes, Ayrton Senna. Oh, there you go. Ayrton Senna's helmet. Um, I'm still waiting for Mini GT to come out with his car uh, so I can have that on display. Look at that Brazil colors. National Renault Elf Ayrton Senna 1994 produced under license from Ayrton Senna Foundation Limited. Oh man, look at that the visor opens. That is beautiful. Wow. It's die cast, by the way. This is like plastic. It's cold, heavy. Like this will cause damage if I hurled it at you. Wow. I, oh man, just thank you, bro. Thank you so much. Ah, don't know what to say. You are, I, I don't even, whatever. Are you, no. Stop, stop with these surprises, bro. I literally feel like a freaking kid on, like, Christmas. Like, you can't buy these feelings, bro. Like, I'm sorry I'm being, like, all feelies or whatever. I don't give a shit, man. Uh, I'm an adult man, and the world is a motherfucking vampire, and, uh... These little moments of joy are priceless, dude. They're priceless. Rob, thank you so much. For everything that's in here. We still haven't looked at your customs. I'm saving the best for last. And uh, we will have a separate video on just the customs. So everyone can enjoy those. I'm going to turn the camera around. And show those. Oh man. You are crazy dude. So this isn't this isn't the custom that, he's, that he uh, made for me. This is I guess he used this as... As a reference for his uh, the custom he was making, so this is Mitsubishi Eclipse Spider uh, Universal Studios. I'm trying to see is this like that fan home release? Cause this is like high quality, bro. Okay. Okay, so this is a smaller scale than uh, 132. So this is like that freaking Mustang. Oh, I know what's going. Come on, Hot Wheels Mustang. Yes. So this is the same scale as the Mustang, the Mach uh, 1. So that's freaking cool. What scale is that? 1? Oh, yeah, 1 43rd. So that's, that's freaking fantastic, man. 1 43rd scale, Roman's Eclipse. Now I have that Mustang and Roman's Eclipse as 143rd scale cars in my collection. Not something I collect, but this will be cherished. That is just fantastic, bro. That is such good quality. It's so nice. Hater. Florida, the hater uh, license plate. That's brilliant. Oh my god. Okay. I don't know, like, you know that movie, um... We're okay, we're okay. Um... 
you know, Will Ferrell, uh, Teledega Nights, where he's like, I don't know what to do with my hands. This is that moment. Like, I'm overwhelmed with the generosity, the thoughtfulness of this box. Ayrton Senna, Fire Truck, Spice Girls, freaking this, um, all of these short cards. This is gonna be a banger at the auction. Really, really hoping for a good turnout, man. We need some people that care. This magazine's amazing. Alright. Okay, this is not staying. Well, I'm just gonna put this over here. Okay, I need a minute. This is crazy. Am I recording? <laughs> okay, yeah. This is a long video, um, deservingly so. Uh, sorry if, if it's too long. We're not gonna waste too much time. So Eclipse we're saving for the very end because it's very personal to me. Let me show you what you guys are gonna be able to get at the auction. So this is the white 83 Chevy Silverado. Oh, it's a two piece. Two piece bikini right there. All right. Man, all right. I'll probably speed up this process. Maybe not, who knows. Is each one in a personal eyeglass? Why, dude, you are too much, bro. Like you spared no expense. It's wrapped in a cloth for glasses. Actually, my, <laughs> mine are all fogged up for some reason. Thank you. How'd you know? Like Nas, your glasses are always dirty. Everything smells so nice too. All right. Oh yeah. I apologize, I have to see this first. I'm a huge fan of Rob's customs ever since the first time years ago he sent uh, his first custom to me, which I'm happy to be the owner of. But um, yeah, look at this. Got the little treasure hunt symbol back there. So my man completely made a insane custom. This is metal base, metal body, beautiful wheels right there. Look at those exhaust tips. The front is amazing. Here's the top. Check out the bottom. <laughs> the interior is detailed. Like you see the stuff in the bed, all of that. The little details are all there. So something super on the little front hoods there. Dude, he painted the inside of the rims blue on this side. But on this side, they're just chrome. This is something Rob's been doing. He did this with the last uh, VW uh, bus that he made. And uh, this is kind of like a signature of, of Rob's. <laughs> blue here chrome here look at the uh, the back window it has his logo and Chevy Hot Wheels nice Silverado there's a little logo on the bottom here as well this thing's beautiful just wait um, each one comes with a custom card art so you're gonna get that car that truck and you're gonna get this with it. In this pack, you will get two stickers, 33 BC. Oh, nice. You're gonna get this beautiful, this is on like thick um, board. So 
look at that right here it says hot wheels for ukraine auction this is his number 21 custom look at that man on the back it says custom number 21 it's signed and it has this beautiful high quality metal plate yeah metal engraved plate with his um logo on there this is legit dude <laughs> i am like okay definitely in presence in presence of greatness this is how professionally things must be done and you will also get two cards i might keep one for myself for memories because the ukraine auction and everything um, I'll ask whoever wins these I'll ask if I can keep a copy I believe his friend uh, makes the card art um, he was like a Photoshop guru I don't know but uh yeah so custom art card art custom car stickers professionalism all around oh yeah we need to face these this is fantastic dude Again, I'm going to make videos of just these, a video of just this stuff, so keep an eye out for that. All right, we got a couple more to open here, so let me get to that. Uh, okay, I'll put these back in later. Whew, what's next? Uh, let's do Red 83 Chevy Silverado. There we go, Silverado, here we go. All right. This is awesome. Anyway, guys, um, please keep an eye out for when this auction's happening. I really hope that uh, we get a good turnout this time. We usually get a good turnout, but with the amount, the level of like professionalism and the amount of amazing stuff sent from a lot of customizers and just donations of cars, supers, whatever. We're going to have a lot of awesome stuff, and uh, your money is going to benefit someone. It's going to benefit Ukrainians that need help, that need food, need shelter. <sighs> you know, all of that. All right. Another cloth. Oh, boy. Uh, yeah, red Chevy Silverado. So... Here we go. Oh, this one's even more customizy. <laughs> I don't know. It's not a word. Okay, so check that out. So pay attention to the wheels as well. See, they're like that here. And that's how they are on this side. I love that he does that. I'm pretty sure he's the first one to be doing that. Check out that grill. That's a very custom touch. He did that last time with the... Um, I forget which car it was, but I love that. I love that. That is so, like, straight-up custom. This thing is beautiful, guys. The paint job is amazing. I'm going to try not to bid on these. I want other people to have Rob's art. I'm going to try not to be <laughs> hoggy. But, man, that is beautiful. What a beaut. Yep, got his logo on the bottom there, of course. Hmm. Rob, you are amazing, dude. The paint job is just flawless. Wow. Yeah, this is like a custom like this. This is a uh, like a hundred dollar level custom. The amount of work, the amount of detail, the amount of craftsmanship, the the sheer like quality of this thing, the fact that it's um metal base, metal body, rubber wheels, the whole shebang. You know what I mean? That is a beauty. Just amazing. 
Okay, um, let's have a look at this pack. So, um, you get all the stickers and stuff, the other card art. Look at that. Another one of these cardboard ones, and then you get the two on paper. 1983 Chevy Silverado, Hot Wheels Free Crane Auction. That way you can have this beautiful piece and a memory of your money going for a good cause. I think that's beautiful, man. I'm trying to keep trying to keep them emotions at bay, dude, because this is amazing. Alright. Next. Make sure I don't hurt these customs that are here already. Alright, next up we're gonna do Jack Daniels SS Gasser. Here it is. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Oh my god, oh my god. I know this is a long video, guys. <laughs> and like I said, I feel like I'm, I got a cold or whatever. Uh, I've been sitting on this. This has been sitting here. Focus. This has been sitting here um, for two days because um, I had all this other crap I had to do and I wanted to actually have time to sit down and do this unboxing video and almost dropping this custom. That would have... Anyway, it didn't happen, so let's move on. A green lens wipe cloth. Oh man, are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Cut the roof. Oh, this one's gonna be uh, on everyone's list. Oh man, dude. Man, dude. <laughs> wow. Look at the weathering, it's like... It's like gold or or um, bronze. It just works. It works so perfectly. Oh, look at those headlights. Bro, look at that. Again, separate videos coming uh, with close-ups and uh, show you everything about this freaking thing. Rob, you have just took this whole thing to a whole other level, my friend. Oh my god. Just look at that. That is fantastic. Dude, the detail of the interior. Look at the headlights, by the way. See those? Wow. What a masterpiece. What a masterpiece. The wheels are amazing. <laughs> also gold on this side. And black on that side. I love it. You have your own thing that you started, dude. I love that. Wow. All right, we need to see the art on that, right? We sure certainly do. Oh, hell yeah. Look at that. That is freaking awesome, man. Just freaking great. <laughs> oh, God. Number 24. Rob, you've definitely outdone yourself with this. Okay. Roman's Eclipse. This is pretty much all I was expecting is this. And we got all that for Ukraine, for me, for you. Oh, that Ayrton Senna helmet, man. That's giving me the feelies. If no one, if someone doesn't know who Ayrton Senna is, check out the documentary simply called Senna, S-E-N-N-A, two N's. It's just his story and uh, his tragic death, but 
Formula One racer. He raced all sorts of cars, but uh, Formula One was like, that's his thing, and he had a specific way of driving, and he was just disciplined, and just an amazing human, and a car guy all around, just... Anyway, Ayrton Senna, he's like on my top five, just all-time human heroes, <laughs> role models, all that good stuff. All right. <sighs> Here we go. I've been waiting for this for so long. Um, Rob was like the one that I had to ask to make this for me uh, because I know he's good at cutting things off. <laughs> so, uh, okay, I don't see it yet. What do you guys think? What do you guys think of this? I hope you can see it. What do you think of that? Think I you think I'll like it? Let's find out. Um Yeah, I think he'll like it. I think he'll like it a lot. Oh man. Wow, you took your time with stuff in here. Did you make the interior? And it's a Hot Wheels. I'm pretty sure you use the Hot Wheel. Yes, that's what makes it. It had to be a Hot Wheels. Oh, man. Okay, so there you go. Um, I don't know what to say, bro. Uh, this is beautiful. He said um, that the wheels aren't like glued in in case I want to find the more proper wheels, I guess, screen accurate. Maybe, maybe I'll change. Uh, I don't know. It depends because you made this. The point is you're the artist and uh, that's what you were able to do. And that's what matters um, to me anyway. Uh, but if if I have any wheels that are more screen accurate, I'll, I'll swap it. But honestly, <laughs> I'm fine. Um, so yeah, guys, look at this. Romans, Eclipse, something Hot Wheels did not make. Um, there is a 164 version of this. I forget who makes it. They go for stupid money. And they're actually not that, like, good looking. I don't know. This is beautiful. This is amazing. Rob, thank you, man. Wow. I'm gonna have fun with the photo shoot of this. You cut the headlights out. Yeah, you were definitely the right one <laughs> to ask for this. He even made a double, but he made a second one yellow, which is a great artistic liberty to take. <laughs> Mirrors. Look at those headlights, man. He cut them out and then filled them, I guess, with hot glue, maybe? Whatever. It's perfect. <laughs> I'm a stickler for headlights. Perfect decals on the back. This thing's a beaut, man. What do I do with my hands? <laughs> Those two trucks and that Jack Daniels you guys get to get. Oh man, let's take a look at the card art. Oh yeah, this is mine, so I can take this out. Ooh, I get three stickers. Hehe, <laughs> suckers. <laughs> um, oh hell yeah, you wrote on it. Look at that. Oh yeah, he asked me um, if I wanted him to sign on the back or the front. To me, the front, man. Um, the artist is in front for me. Um, to Nas, enjoy your custom. You're building a nice Fast and Furious collection. Best wishes from across the pond, Rob and Monica, 33 DC. Thank you, sir. Oh, man. And I actually didn't get a signature. <laughs> At all. That's cool. I know where you live. <laughs> this is awesome. 
I love these little plates you got made up, dude. A little metal etched. That is fantastic, bro. The card art is just... <sighs> All right, let's see. Let's look at these puppies right here. We got two of those. This one, I'll definitely cut one of these out and put it on a card or um, a protector or whatever. But yeah, look at that. Where are you? Where are you, buddy? <laughs> Don't drop this one, Nas. No, sir. There it is. How cool is this thing? All right, there you go, guys. Um, that's it. That is it for this box. I'm gonna need a nap after this because this is insane. This is so much like emotion on different levels. Uh, the reason for these donations for Ukraine, the war, um, the good kind people like Rob and Monica uh, and other people that are donating for this. The amazing people that are going to be bidding for this and have bid on this. The money that we've sent to Ukraine. Um, just the kindness and generosity of people. I appreciate all those things, you know what I mean? And, um, yeah. Look at that. I just, it's just freaking cool. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do a recap, dude, that fire truck. The, I mean, come on, bro. You're, like, the most thoughtful person. <laughs> I am I'm blessed with good people that surround me. Uh, the nostalgic community is amazing. The diecast community that I'm a part of is amazing. Um, you guys are just beautiful. Like, so many good, kind people that just uh, i don't know like we're all going through a lot of different crazy you know shit uh we all have difficulties in our lives we all try to you know take care of our families our kids our our parents you know grandparents uh we try to help others uh, we struggle with our own bills we struggle with repairs for everything you know and uh some people choose to do more. Some people choose to do all those things, go to work every day, spend their life working, and then maybe make, you know, customs or do other hobbies. And then on top of that, put aside a certain amount of money to help others, like, selflessly, without, like, beating the, themselves on the chest or yelling about it, you know, or, me, I'm doing this, you know what I mean? Um, I'm just so blessed to have friends, you know, like you, uh, Rob and Monica, uh, that are doing this, that are donating, donating their time, their money, their skills, uh, just, just amazing, man. Like, we don't know what happens after this world, you know, ends and whatever, but like doing good, it makes you feel good, you know, and, uh, I appreciate people like that, uh, you know. Just selfless, good people. So, I'm glad to have that in my life. Um, totally. Before I start crying, and I have to go <laughs> blow my nose, I guess. Uh, don't worry, I'm not going to cry. I'm a man. I'm manly. <laughs> I have a beard. I have a beard and shit. I say shit and stuff, so I'm super manly. Uh, um, hold on. I need a knife here. They're super manly. So yeah, uh, thanks everyone for watching. Uh, Rob, thank you, dude. Uh, this is a long ass video, I know. Um, thanks everyone that watched and lasted till the end. This was crazy, I can't believe it. Um, yeah, another video is coming with the review and showcase of these four customs from Rob. There's also going to be lots of videos coming with other customs. There's a lot of customs from people. Guys, March 23rd, uh, it's going to be a Saturday. Hopefully, we'll all be able to be there. Uh, you know, set aside a couple of bucks for that auction and uh, bid generously because that money, I'm not keeping any of it, guys. 100% is going to Ukraine. And um, we, we're trying to help people here. That's the point of 
everything that's done here with diecast and these Hot Wheels for Ukraine auctions that we do here on the Nostalgic channel. Let's help some people. Let's continue this. I appreciate all of you. Let's let's fight evil with good. That's what we're doing here. So yeah, thanks everyone. Peace, love, and unity. Slava Ukraini, Heroyam Slava, Smerť Klatem Vorohan. Bye everyone.